Fortnite is already on Season 6 of Chapter 2. Time flies. It feels like almost yesterday, Fortnite became a hit. And it feels like mere hours ago, we were all chilling on Fortnite Season 6, Chapter 1, for Halloween. Good times. Good times. Falling out of the game is simple, and it happens for a ton of reasons. I think for many, the issues are, it's the same thing every season. Sure, Fortnite seasons have new gimmicks and collaborations each time, but dying by a four-star hotel builder or facing through builds alone transcends seasons and chapters. This is the return of Fortnite horror on this channel. I hope you're prepared for a scare. I played Season 6 for the first time last night. Everything is so different. A true bold move in my opinion. And building seems to be a little bit smoother. I like the fact that primal weapons and makeshift weapons are the majority. And things like the AR and pump, you can still find on the ground, but they're much harder to acquire. This makes the game have an almost save the world type feel but in a battle royale setting. I started to play even more games, but things felt off. And I don't mean in a time-skippy way Fortnite does their events. I mean, I felt off, like I wasn't here or <laughs> alive. You know the feeling you get when you're up too high and feel like you might fall? It was like that. I didn't get out much anymore, so to say having something to play again was nice. I tried to look on my friends list to invite people, but there was no friends list feature. What? I started to get angry and I threw my phone down. Oh yeah, I didn't have friends anymore. Not since the... I tried to find my phone that I threw in my small room, but I, I couldn't find it. It had to be here. It, it had to be somewhere. Where's my phone? Where's my phone? I, I, I have to play season six. This is our most interesting patient here. You might have heard about him from your professor at college before your medical visit here. I assure you, he's harmless to others. Excuse me, ma'am. Can, can I ask you a question? Certainly. Is he harmful to himself? Oh, very much so. He has multiple personalities, and sometimes they don't get along. Here, get a closer look at what this does to the human mind. Where's my phone? Where's my phone? Where's my phone? Why did you throw it? Why did you throw it? You made me. Don't do it again. I, I might do it again. <laughs> there is no phone. There is nothing. Just what he and his multiple personalities create. Usually it's of fond memories before the illness got too bad, before his friends abandoned him, or his family quit visiting. It's truly a sad- Will he ever get better? I don't believe so. Hey, what is up Scary Squad? I hope that you enjoyed today's video. If you'd like to keep the spooks on coming, I highly recommend joining my Discord server. I host Q&As, I host video game sessions where you can play Among Us and Fortnite with me, and you can also meet fans like yourself and make friends. Link down below. Don't forget to subscribe!